So I told her, right? It's either my way or the highway. You really said that? Hell yeah. Where would I lie? Well, I don't know. It just doesn't sound like you, man. Yeah, whatever. What about you, lady? What about what? Yeah. Do you do everything she says without putting your foot down? Of course not. You've always been like that. <laughs> hey, what are you talking about? You've been a man in your whole life, just like me. I have not. Yeah? What else have you done? Yeah, I don't want to say. Yeah, right. You're just like us grunts, working day by day, just to pay the rent. And on top of that... You really want to know, huh? Sure, tell me. Okay. Don't tell anyone. I don't want to lose my license. It was about three years ago. Back then, I was contracted to eliminate a badass dude. That's the dumbest thing I've heard you say in a long time. It's not. You're telling me that you were a bounty hunter? <laughs> all right, all right. Don't choke on your frozen food, man. You wanna hear the story or not? Yeah, sure. Why not? Go on. Okay. About three years ago, so I was contracted to eliminate a badass dude called Kaka. You serious? His name is Kaka? Are you gonna keep doing this? No, no, no. Sorry. Continue. Mm. Anyway. His name was Kaka. The dude was? You can't spoil the story? Yeah, 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 okay. So, I was contracted to eliminate a badass dude called Kaka Nokanoa. The price on that dude's head had reached over 30 billion isk, and someone had to stop him. The area he was currently occupying was way out of concourse jurisdiction, so it had to be me. I had two days to get the job done. If I failed, we might have lost him for good. I left Ida with a special built condor. A condor, huh? Special built. It is funny how space is so empty, but when I arrived, it felt even more so. Cloaked, I scanned the system for what felt a long time, but I didn't have to. He was already here, and he was not alone. I did pick up his transmission and, and set my ship to translate. They were talking about recently recovered passcodes and a promising plex trade. But I also picked up that they needed missiles. I remember thinking that they might have been low on ammo, and if so, this would be the time to strike. The feeling was tense, and I would lie if I didn't say I was a bit nervous. I made sure everything was in order, and I intercepted the transmission. As I gently pressed the uncloak, I locked them all. With the afterburner active, I moved straight towards them. They didn't shoot back? Of course they did. They started firing. But as I avoided their cruise missiles, I threatened them in their own transmission. Your time is up. And they stopped shooting. I figured they had no more missiles. Hey, <laughs> what a bunch of noobs. So then you killed them, huh? Do I look like I have 30 billion esque? No, I didn't kill them. My contract was only to catch them. Anyway, Concord finally warped in and took over. I did actually get an offer to join Concord, or take a crash course, as they call it. But I got my family, you know, all that. Yeah, I call bullshit. You always say this weird stuff. My shift is over, by the way. I catch you tomorrow. Yeah. I'll see you then. Yeah, bring more missiles next time, idiots. <laughs> you come up to me right now. I got him. So where are they? They were right here. They must have had some new technology or something. Where's your scrambler? Oh. Idiot.